day before Easter. Today, you guys, I am just getting ready for tomorrow. Easter Sunday, I know that the bunny and the eggs don't have anything to do with Easter, but I like to keep up with the tradition of things because ever since I was a little girl, I got Easter baskets, dresses, and the little panties with ruffles and all of that stuff. And I just, I just like the, the tradition of things. So I'm not really looking at it as if it has anything to do with, um, you know, the Bible or anything like that. Although I do know what Easter means or what Resurrection Day is. So I just want to make that clear with you guys. But to keep up with the tradition of the holiday, this is why I do crafts and we cook dinner. We have time with our family. But anyways, guys, you guys get what I'm saying here. So here is my table with a whole huge mess of things and then we have lovey lovey show everybody your dress girl you say hello lovey's about to get some eggs going i've already um boiled eggs last night i just made like a dozen and i'm going to put some stuff together for my nieces like what do you guys get boys that's like almost 12 years old what do you guys get them for easter even though I have an idea what I'm gonna get Amari, but these little crafts that I'm doing today are really for my nieces because they're girls and um, even though they're 11, they could still appreciate this type of stuff. So I'm doing that. I baked cake last night, yay! So sweet, Cake Boutique is coming back on the scene. I got my mixer out. Um, I got that still sitting out because I have to make the icing for my cake so I can get them ready and packed all up because um, we're gonna have dinner at my sister-in-law's house also um, I'm gonna be going to they have like a Buford farmers market out here but it's like a grocery store but it's a farmers market I did a video in there before and I just showed you guys with all the Thing, all the things that they have there and I'm looking for turkey legs and turkey wings so I know around this time or even often I, I look for them in the store I really don't see them there so I'm hoping that they have them over at the Buford market so I'm excited to go there today and uh, Amari and babe is getting haircuts um He's back home. Uh, he, he <laughs> it's so funny because he's in and out, and when he comes back home, he looks a mess. He smells a mess, just funky, just, just not together. So he got to get his life together because he have today and tomorrow off, and back he goes like it's constant. So, anyways, enough of that. I'm gonna show you guys how I create some of these little. Uh, crafts i was gonna call them like diys but i guess it could be but anyways enough of that let's get right into it Just pop some candies in there and there's a little treat gift. 
All right guys, so next I'm gonna show you how to make a carrot cart. And here are your Rice Krispie Treats with Chocolate Drizzle. All right, you guys, so I'm finally done with my treats and I'm ready to show you guys what they came out looking like after they done. So here we go. I made these little treats here. I didn't show you guys these because this was just something extra that I threw in. But look how cute my little carrot garden came out. Really, really cute and fun. And then here is my little Rice Krispie treats. I did two different colors. And I just put two little peeps in there with some eggs and candies in there. And here are the necklaces that I made. You guys, this would be cute to add money to it and, you know, little coins or whatever you feel would be nice to go inside. But there it is. And I uh, hope they'll enjoy this. I have one more thing that I'm going to be working on, but that's going to be off camera. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video today. It was somewhat like a vlog, DIY, Easter, so and so. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up. I hope you guys have an amazing Easter, spending time with your family and friends. And as always, you guys, I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys.